if you are watching this video is either you're your topping is stuck on the way uh, to meta max or maybe you just want to learn all right okay this is officially a video on how to recover bmb actually sent to meta max wallet that ain't reflecting on the wallet all right so a uh, long time ago i made this video on how to recover coins sent to wrong address and through that video that was actually a mistake i made a mistake i panicked it took me with about 24 hours before I could learn the processes on, on how to recover that coin and when I finally did, I made that video and through that video, I can say we've recovered over 200000 $200, dollars all right, and we are still counting, all right, that's different from the ones that uh, users recover on their own without letting me know or maybe like they just send testimonials, but the one that comes to me, all right, those that can recover on their own. So, that being said, that has been really helpful to so many persons the testimonial is massive all right without wasting much time so this is a deliberate video i deliberately sent uh, a bmb from uh, binance to metamax just to make this tutorial all right so if you want to support me you can send some donation smart chain or ethereum to the wallet address below all right because i do invest into tutorials like this all right that being said so I sent a uh, $10 worth of BNB to my MetaMask address and it's not reflecting and I'm going to show you in this video how to actually go about it, how to make it reflect, if after doing all you, what you have to do and it's still not reflecting, what to do and what another option to go with, alright? So you might have to stay tuned from the beginning of this video to the end because there are vital tips that I've laid, it's just like a total course. All right, uh, tutorial course on 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 this uh, recovering BNB sent to MetaMask. All right, so everything that you need to understand, I've actually explained it in this video. All right. So here's the most cases that um, do happen. All right, most persons send. Let's let me go to my MetaMax. Log into my MetaMax now. The most cases, most persons do send a uh, coin from Trust Wallet to MetaMax. Let's say BNB from Met, uh, Trust Wallet to MetaMax, or they send or they send a BNB or they send or they send BNB from uh, Binance to uh, MetaMax and it doesn't reflect. Now this is the this is where the problem is. Now MetaMax is officially built on a Ethereum address. Look at because of this video, I had to do a case study test. Uh, I have to you know perform this transaction so that you can actually see how uh, this can be worked out. All right. So this is a case of me sending. BNB smart chain or BNB to my trust wallet and it's not reflecting. Okay, let me show you for instance now. Let me add BNB. Uh, let's type in BNB. Let's add BNB token here so that you see what I'm talking about. All right, if I click on add token right here, add token, add token, then I search here BNB. Alright, so BNB came up and then let me add it. Okay, added. See, I don't have any balance, but I sent BNB to this wallet. But you can see I don't have any balance right here. Okay, so now this is what to do exactly. And this is before we go on with the tutorial, I need to make you understand something. If you check at the top of this wallet, you will see you will see it written Ethereum main network now uh every metamax wallet is built on ethereum network you understand so uh this is on ethereum network this is uh on ethereum network so now the why, why sending uh let's say bnb from um, binance to your metamax most likely you might want to boycott uh, the plenty fees that uh, comes with uh, uh 
uh, Ethereum network, and then you might want to choose Smart Chain. And most most cases, uh, what is always there is Smart Chain. All right, let me click on BNB right here. All right, now what is always here is Smart Chain. All right, and other networks are not always here. So eventually, when you send it from Binance to uh, to MetaMax, it doesn't reflect. Now this is how to go about it. Okay. Now the first thing we are going to have to do is to change this network here from Ethereum network to Smart Chain network. So through recovery video on how to recover coins sent to the wrong address, I've been able to meet so many cases and I've been able to work with so many scenarios and then I've been able to prepare a whole lot of materials. All right, that one single videos cannot take them all because there are so many ways people lost their coin all right so uh those persons that might want to you know enroll into a full course on how to recover coins sent to wrong address please check the link in the description you see i it's, uh, it's there you can join okay it's about 300 dollars all right so you have to i get to lead you through different ways all right on how to recover coins sent to wrong address and then those that want to learn crypto you know I'm already teaching crypto here, but there are those persons that need you to hand feed them, all right, to learn everything in detail, all right, like to spend time with them one on one, all right. So they are, though that's not mine, all right, but it's a verified link on uh, on crypto. It's a verified crypto course, all right. So you can take them down in the description. So without further ado, let's just dive right into the video right now. Mind you, for the uh, if at the end of this video you are not able to do yours correctly or let's say you you don't understand this, feel free to send me email and then I could assist you to do this properly. Okay, or or send me an Instagram message. I will also assist you. It's the the link in the description. There's a link in the description. So check it out. Now let's continue with the video. Also, if you like my video, most of this video, I actually spend money trying to work them out. And you can see how to, you know, carry on a case study. So if you want to support my channel, there's a BNB smart chain donation button right there. You can send Ethereum, you can send BNB to the address, I will receive it. All right, just send and comment that you sent me something and then I'll really appreciate and it will help improve uh, the channel and I'll use it for more case studies. All right, let's continue now. First thing you are going to have to do right here is to go to uh, go to this uh, button right here at the top left left hand side this button right here all right go to this button right here and then what we are going to do there is we are going to add a new network all right then you click on settings now when you click on settings now it will take you to this angle here now when you are here you click on um, network all right this is where we are going to click on network all right you can see here that there are list list of different networks we have the first one which a uh, which a uh, metamask is, is, is built on is ethereum main network all right then we have other networks right here all right this one you are seeing here i added them all right so now what we are going for here is we are going here we we came here to actually add a new network which is the smart chain network all right so i already added it all right and then i'll show you how to do yours all right the details are already provided in the description of this video all right so you you just copy it and add it up all right so now you're going to click click on add new network and the details i'm going to provide in the description of this video you're going to copy it and paste it in here all right so let's go back okay let's see what i feel there click on this now you can see here the first one is name is smart chain all right the name doesn't really matter that much but for you to recognize that it's matching just name is smart chain all right but either you name is smart chain or you don't name is smart chain it is still smart chain all right then the uh, ropc url copied and pasted it in the description then the chain id is 56 then the symbol is bnb it doesn't really matter that much it, it's already bnb so whether you like it or not, whatever number I give it to it, so whatever the whatever symbol you give it to it, so but put it BNB. Then then the explorer is bscan.com. All right. So once you are done with that, you click save or add network in your own case. All right. So once that is done, 
uh let me click on it here if i just tap on it boom okay once that is done now your network will automatically change will automatically change from this ethereum mainnet to bnb but since i've added my all i just need to do is to click here uh, so um most likely this is how your wallet will show so eventually when you add the new network yours will just reflect but because i've added my i need to make the switch all right before so i'll click smart chain here and boom it will just reflect boom your congratulation you have your coin back all right so it's just as simple as that so it's just as simple as that you have your coin added to your wallet congratulations so if you have any challenges please uh email me all right and then i'll be able to help you out all right my email is on the screen on or maybe send me a message on instagram so if this was helpful to you you can send some donation so if this was helpful to you you can support the channel with little donation if you so wish thank you see you in my next video